Hey guys, I have a really cool app review today for you. It's uh, an app review on Street Fighter IV Vault. And it's actually available right now at the App Store for $2.99. And I assure you, go buy it. This game is a really good game. If you guys are into fighting games, any kind of action, maybe you guys know of Tekken for the Xbox and PlayStation. It's kind of similar. Um, so let's get into the specs of it. open this up here uh, when you open it you can't you can't unfortunately you can't play the game like holding it like this with your with the home home button here you have to hold it this way but it's not really that bad okay. as you see when you uh, open it up it gives you the preview video let's push that it's pretty nice As you see, guys, that intro video is really nice. Street Fighter 4. And if you have that retinal display, it really shows that, that deep, rich crispiness that the, that the video provides for you. So you see here, tap the screen. You start the game up. It signs you into the Game Center. I don't have a Game Center uh, account. But I will make one. So here you have a solo play. The Bluetooth versus, which meaning it. There's another iPod or iPhone. So if there's another iPod or iPhone or iPad that has this game, you don't have Wi-Fi connection or anything. You just link it up with the Bluetooth and then they connect. Your stats to see, you know, online stats to see, you know, how good other people are and their game records, how you are, comparisons. Um, then you have your recommendations. You have your player cards and your online verses. Uh, so let's jump into the solo play. You have your arcade, survival, uh, free sparring, training room, and your challenge. Now, for now, we're just going to jump into the arcade mode. You can set your difficulty by just tapping on it. Through a wing, beginner. So I played this a couple times, so I'm going to put that on normal. Uh, you could choose how many rounds you want. SP move assistance. Um, and your auto guard, which is, auto guard is pretty good to have on because you know if you're if you're not tapping anything when the other opponent hits you, it kind of automatically blocks it, which is nice. Let's tap OK. As you see, you have all different types of characters. So you tap on them to see which one of your liking. This question one, if you tap it again, it just comes up. It's just a random character not a special one. So I like to use this guy here, Sagat. You double tap, and then you have a color choice here of either blue or green. I think the color green, so I'm going to go with that. So as you see, I'm reversing him gives you all these extra little options that you can choose from. Begin or check commands. Let me just start here. Okay, you see guys, this is very responsive. It is really nice. And I'll show you guys, a, um, there's like a special move that you can do in this game when you tap on these. After you get a certain amount on these bars that load up here, 
I don't know if it's gonna work. Oh, yeah, it does work. There you go. You just have to have one box like that. So he does a super move. And here on your top left, it'll say 18 hit combo. So it tells you how many combos he did. I'm not too good at this game. As you see, I'm uh, losing pretty bad now. Let's try to beat him up. And I lost. That's unfortunate. It's really nice, guys. Especially if you have this retinal display. It looks amazing. It's not hard to do any moves, as you see here. The responses are, you know, you can be, you don't have to really tap it hard. You just barely tap it at all. Move back. You jump up. You jump up and go down. Do like a special kick move. So yeah, as you see, the auto, the auto block. I'm not pressing nothing when he gets to hit me. So, not bad. Just like a regular punch or something. The block hit. That wasn't good. So, I'm gonna lose. Again. Wow. And that's a normal, guys. As you see, it's uh, a little tough. I'm not so good at this. <laughs> so, as you see, when you lose, you can see the results and your time and everything. Usually, you just keep going uh, one character after another. Then you fight on arcade mode with seven, and then it shows you uh, how many fights you win in a certain amount of time. Tap that. You can continue yes or no. Let's go with more here. You have to double tap it. Game so you see the animation is falling. <laughs> So overall, this game is really good, guys. Um, the buttons are very responsive. It's not laggy at all. There's a nice different types of options here that you can uh, choose from. It's only, again, $2.99 at the App Store. So I, I recommend it. It's a really good game. And I I'm not into Street Fighter because I played the first one and I wasn't too fond of it. And I've seen this one, so this one, this one's really good. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. This is that Zesty Apple Kid, guys, coming with you uh, another app review. Hope you guys keep watching my videos. I've been making them constantly now. So uh, yeah, you guys have a great day. Please comment, rate, subscribe, which will uh, be very nice. And uh, yeah, see you guys in the next video. Peace.